I think this subject is so important for us to discuss because we are always on the both sides of the fence there, right? We are always playing the customer role, but we are always, we, we don't need to be an entrepreneur or have a business to know how to treat our clients well. If you work for any employer, you also have clients. And you also need to learn, need to understand what, what makes them happy. Because if they are happy, they will buy more. If they buy more, your employer will grow and therefore you will grow together. But also as a person, right? The relationship between people. If you work in a counter, a cashier, or also uh, taking phone calls or making phone calls, answering to to to, uh, to to queries or or making sales, whatever. You're always dealing with people, and we have this subject in our in our methodology call, called client satisfaction. Satisfaction. It does. Uh, people open for debate when I created this subject because they want to call, they want to call customer service or guest satisfaction, and I like calling client satisfaction because everyone is a client, and it's nice because our friend Bruno Varallo, who who deals with this subject so well, he taught me that. Uh, once you start seeing your client, start believing that your client is a guest, calling them a guest, you will start treating them differently. Because when people come to your place, to your home, or to your store, and then you, you see them as, as your guest, you treat them differently. So if you treat the same way your clients, whether you are in business or working for someone else, you know you will treat them better. But what, what, what is different between a client relationship in Europe, Brazil, and America, Tarita? Why do you think it's, it's so different? If you were to, to say, like in one word, what is different there, in your opinion? How, be, how, how, how good you are treated? Actually, we, we, we have to talk about two different things. That is uh, the rights that you have uh, as okay. a customer. It's different to the what we are talking about, right? Your rights because as a customer. The, yeah, because the people, for example, in Brazil, we don't have this that we can buy and we can return the thing so easy as we can here in Europe and in America. Oh, you yeah. just can change your mind and go back to the store and the same I just want to return, I want my money back. So it's, You mean it's, when, when you don't like something, right? Yeah, it's a uh, right. Yeah. But people take yeah. advantage of that. Yes, but you can, not if you if you don't like it, but you can just change your mind. You know, I, I decide that I, I spent too much and I want my money back. You can go to the store and get the, the money back. So it's different to the, the customer service that we are talking about, right? The care that we should have with the customers. Yeah, but yeah, when, when you go to a situation like that, you, 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 you always have the response of the person uh, yeah. interacting so with you. We have a two different treatments. There are people that they are just there to receive your your merchandise. Yeah, your your, goodie. your I don't know. And uh, they just oh, okay, that's fine. They don't and, discuss. Yeah, they don't discuss. They don't smile, and they don't smile. <laughs> they don't they don't put themselves in your place. Okay. Because you. The, the good customer service would ask you why, what happened, why did you decide to change, if you changed your mind, that's fine, it's your right, but you know, mm. it's the different pre treatment. It's actually, it's so different uh, when you, when you go, sorry, I interrupted you. And then you can see the difference. Uh, 
from uh, hello good morning meeting europe and the america because the america it's it's the right that you have you can go and change many as many times as you want all right you just try if you, if you want to go 10 times at the same place change the same not the same thing but with the same receipt you you go just changing the receipt but they they don't have customer services in in america they are always grumpy and uh, so rude they give you what you want because it's your right but and do you think that when a when a person comes to you and ask what was wrong with your with your product do you think that they take this somewhere else your information do you think that they they get this information from you and take to their to their um, employer i think it depends on the employer on the policies that they they have to follow maybe or if if it's a good person that wants to develop them their career you know and they want to bring that yeah uh, yeah. That's, a, that's that's something that I want to... So I think this, this is uh, the most important difference between Europe and America because the, we didn't have uh, good experiences in America. As customers, yes. Yeah, as customers and uh, everywhere. Depends, right? Even, even to visit a building or buying something or... Yeah, it depends, but we cannot talk about the Vegas. Vegas is, is outside of America. And Florida. Florida. Yeah, yeah. Because they are always happy. They are always on holidays because people are there always. I always holidays. come I always bring this back. I always think I always think that there is a strong relationship between the weather and the, the, the mood um, of people. And I, I, I don't think so, because the, you can go to New York in the summer and uh, you won't be treated well. 